open ai whisper and gpt4 had a baby and that baby can definitely take your productivity to the moon and that is exactly what audio pen is audio pen is a web application where you can go speak whatever you like it's going to capture everything that you say and convert into text in fact not just like simply the literal text of what you convert but it uses gpt4 to customize it summarize it add title change the style a lot more other things this tool is by default a free tool but you have an option to subscribe for a prime user which is like a paid to paid option just a disclaimer this is not a sponsored video i have not been paid to make this video in fact the only thing that i'm going to get is i'm going to add an affiliate link in the youtube description so i might get a commission if you buy this tool if you like it otherwise you can simply use the free tool so the reason i'm making this video is one i just absolutely love this tool if for example if you're a content creator let's say you make youtube videos you write blogs or you just do a lot of content creation there is a moment when you would not want to type you would not want to use your fingers and you would not want to type you might be lazy enough you might be tired or you have this thing called writer's block and that is a moment you would always want somebody to be next to you where they can listen to you and just listen to you just listen to you and then tell you back what you just said sometimes even summarize it sometimes say in the style and give it to you that's exactly this tool is this is you have got like other tools like mac whisper that can literally take what you just said transcribe it and give it to you back but this tool even at the free version is quite amazing because you can now save voice notes that will be transcribed into english or whatever language that you speak and then it is going to give you back as a text and then that text could be now used to do a lot of different things so i'm going to show you a quick demo of this tool so that you know how the tool works and you can also see different options of this tool and then we can discuss about various use cases how i use this particular tool and how probably you can use the tool for example let's say i'm going to go here and then click this microphone icon let me click it after i click it it's going to ask for permission first i give the permission then i can start saying something what if open ai whisper and gpt4 had a baby it might take your productivity to the moon and this is quite amazing but what a chaotic life that would be where you can just tell it to somebody and then ask them to repeat it back to you wouldn't it be amazing or would it be chaotic i mean i don't know i'm just saying some random crap if you want to summarize this summarize this but otherwise it's fine so i'm going to stop this and then i'm going to let it upload so the voice note that we just recorded is going to get uploaded it is getting transcribed using open ai whisper now it is getting rewritten using chat gpt or gpt4 once it gets rewritten you are going to get access for particular note very similar like a post it once you get it you can use it for pretty much anything you can use it for video scripting well okay we have got it like you can see whisper gpt4 hybrid productivity or cast so it exactly taken whatever i just said it has rewritten it a little bit it added a nice title if you want to add a tag you can add a nice tag for example i can say ramblings and i can save it the tag is available here now you can share it with somebody you can even download the raw audio let's say you are doing a podcast so you want to record the audio but also you want to capture the transcript not just the transcript but you want to add time stamps to it this is another great tool so you can download the audio if you create an image based on this like it can create an image based on this what is the image that you want uh, you want a perfect size for twitter okay let's do perfect size for twitter and click create so it can create an image so now what we have done we have just combined the open ai ecosystem where we have taken the voice note that i just spoke and then we have converted it to text rewrote the text using gpt4 and then currently an image is being generated um so this this is the image that is being generated which you can now share it on twitter or wherever the social media that you are part of the thing that a lot of people do not know about this particular tool is you can go here and then change the style for example you can rewrite this entire thing you can change how much is the level that you wanted to rewrite and you can just say for example i can say write in the style of um, whatever the writer you like shake spear i don't know if the spelling is correct but yeah let me save the style and done now i can go ahead and then change the style like for example i can go here and then change the style of this so that this text would whatever language that i speak in it would look like it has been spoken by shakespeare so that's that's the style and you have got multiple more styles for you to pick like for example one thing that i just said is like write in the style of a shakespeare but you have got like the casual memo style simple clear descriptive and all these things i think these are just part of the prime uh, the paid option but if you get free option you get uh, um, the normal transcription that is available for you 
And the other thing is, like right now, you know, for sure, like because you're watching our channel, you know that I've got a very thick Indian accent. But the fact here is that because Whisper is so good at understanding different accents, not just different accents, one, it can understand different accents, but it can also pick up different languages. For example, you've got all these languages. I can, for example, select Tower as a transcription language and I can say um, rewrite it. Now, when I say rewrite it, and you can see that it is going to start rewriting it. If you if you have spoken it in a different language, it can pick that up, it can rewrite it, and then it can finally save it in the new style that you wanted it to be rewritten. And this is all a part of a web application. You can download it as a PWA, uh, like a progressive web application, or like, okay, we have, we have got it as a Shakespeare tone. For offspring bring to the moon, thy productivity might spring. Okay, anyways, I didn't understand the, I didn't read any of Shakespeare's work when I, except when I was in high school. But anyway, this is quite mind blowing. You may not realize it until you use it. This is just like your simple notes application, but the fact that you can just speak to it and then it can take your content, it can create articles, it can, it can do everything, right? So everything that we, as humans, like I'm more naturally, I can speak than I can type. And when I'm speaking, because I'm not a native English speaker, sometimes I make mistakes. I make I make a lot of mistakes and um, I'm not good at conveying some certain messages in a way that everybody would understand. Imagine there is an AI that is sitting just listening to you and then listening to every single word that you're saying in different accents and then it can take that and then it can go ahead and then it can convert it and give it to you in a way that everybody would understand. I think this is quite amazing for people who are who love content creation, who love storing their thoughts um, in voice notes. Like if you're somebody who uses post it a lot, if you take a lot of ideas and take notes of it, this is quite amazing. Also, as a matter of fact, it has got a Chrome plugin. Like if you use Brave or anything, you can use the plugin. And any website, wherever you are, you can start recording it. What does it mean? It also means, for example, I can watch a video. That audio can also go into it. And then I can now transcribe it and I can start using it. So the applications are quite endless. The way I am personally using it, I'm using it to create my video scripts. A um, lot of times I get a small idea. Uh, for example, the, one of the things that I recently created is uh, I'm, the, one of the videos that I'm currently working on is how chaotic the open source licensing is, especially in the AI system, like not, not generally open source, but especially in AI, everybody has a version of open source license. I'm trying to work on this video, but you know, every day I'm busy, every day I cannot work on it because of a lot of reasons. But what I started doing is I started storing them into smaller, smaller voice notes. What I can actually ultimately do is I can just select like a bunch of voice notes and I can probably ask it to create a summary of it. Now, I've got two different voice notes and I can add it together and create a super summary. So this way I can, you know, just while I'm going in the cab to my office, I can record something when I'm coming back home, I can record something. I can record something before I go to sleep, like over a period of few days, I would actually have like a good structured video content and uh, I can even see, set a style. I can say that right like a YouTube YouTuber, right like Mr. Beast, I can set a style and that can actually ultimately give me this video. I think, to be honest, like I'm quite, quite happy with this tool and uh, this is quite amazing as a matter of fact that this exists and uh, it is quite simple UI. And uh, what the good thing that I like in this particular tool at least is, let's say one day you decided that you don't want this, you don't want to use this tool anymore. You can go ahead and record your data. You can completely record, your, uh, sorry, delete your data. You can completely wipe off everything. And that is quite amazing. So now you might ask me, hey, why are you not using Mac Whisper? Why are you using this? I use an Intel Mac. And uh, whenever I use Mac Whisper, my Intel Mac's fan is just like completely burning hot. I can make an omelet on top of it. So I don't want to make every other application of mine freeze while I'm recording it. And if you really care about open source, I would strongly encourage you to use uh, tools um, that are available. We, I have got a huge playlist of Whisper. You can do everything from speaker diarization, to everything that you want to do. But if you want a simple tool, all it all you want is like, uh, let's say an Evernote or a noting application that can simply take your voice note, store it, record it for you, help you do a bunch of things like change the style, create a super summary and like bunch of other things. And that is exactly what you should be using for. And this tool, like I said, it has got a free version and it has got a prime version, which is a paid version. And you can go ahead and then see how good it is. Like the lifetime deal is $150. That's like 
you don't have to pay any money after that at all and that offer is available till 26 september and if you don't want you just want to use it for one year then you get to pay 75 dollars and use it for one year you are not paying for whisper api you are not paying for gpt4 api but you can just pretty much use it and uh, the developer has done a tremendous job in uh, giving all the exclusive benefits what all you can do you can write it in different styles you can integrate it with zapier record longer voice notes upload the audio files as well like i can say like if you have got a podcast you can just take the mp3 upload it here transcribe it get the timestamp and it can help you do a lot of other things you can save unlimited notes you've got the images to share on social media to go viral and it can create super summary and bunch of other things i don't want to go into every single detail but i absolutely love this tool that's why i'm making a video about uh, about a tool that i loved if you like the tool if you think this is useful for your uh, let's say uh, content creation or creative purposes or even just to appreciate how somebody can take whisper api somebody can take gpt4 api put together a very brilliant simple use case go ahead and purchase this tool otherwise use the free tool and then see how it works i want to link the affiliate link in the youtube description like i said a disclosure this is not a paid promotion the affiliate link will just help me get some commission but you're completely free to use the free tool and then see how the tool performs and if you are building such a nice amazing tool please dm me i'm definitely looking forward to try out your tool and share it with my audience if it is nice and it is helpful see you in another video happy prompting